Isabel Briggs Myers and her mother Catherine Briggs began developing the Myers Briggs type indicator in the 1940s as a way of helping people choose suitable work and to promote the constructive use of differences. According to the Myers and Briggs Foundation, millions of people worldwide have taken the indicator each year since its first publication in 1962. The principal theory is this. We all use four basic functions. Two of them help us process information. Two of them help us make decisions. The information processing functions are sensing and intuition. Sensing is scanning the environment and taking in the data through the senses, the things we can see, touch, hear, etc. Intuition takes it a step further by interpreting or adding meaning. This is what we often describe as reading between the lines or having a gut feeling. Each person has a preference of one over the other. An S in the Myers-Briggs code indicates a preference for sensing. An N indicates a preference for intuition. Once the information has been processed, we use one of the other two functions to make our decisions. These are thinking and feeling. Thinkers prefer to focus on logic, the logical consequences that will flow out of their decision, basic if-then statements. Whereas feelers add a people element into the mix, the likely consequences on the people involved in the situation, their desires or values, and the unique circumstances at play. And just like with sensing and intuition, if a T is in the Myers-Briggs code, that person has a preference for making their decisions via thinking, if it is an F, by feeling. Each person also chooses a dominant function, one of these four, which is their favorite to use. It is the function they develop first, usually by age 7, and is the one they are most skilled at using. By age 20, they have also developed what's known as the auxiliary or secondary function. This is used to support the dominant function. Together, these two functions often make up 75% or more of a person's behavior. The third, or tertiary function, develops in the 30s and 40s, and the fourth, or inferior function, develops midlife or later. Additionally, each function is either introverted to help with the internal world or extroverted to help with the external world. When the possibilities of function order and direction are considered, you can quickly discover that there are 16 possible combinations and this is where we get the 16 different personality types. The goal of knowing about personality type is to understand and appreciate differences between people. There is no right or wrong, good or bad type. All types are equal. But the seemingly random differences in the way people behave are actually quite consistent and predictable due to basic, measurable differences in the way they process information and make decisions. This assessment does not measure trait, ability, or character. It sorts for preference which account for unique interests, reactions, values, motivations, and skills. To learn more about your specific Myers-Briggs type, visit our blog at excellenceinlearningllc.com. Or, if you have completed the Discover Me profile, your consultant will be sure to review your specific type and answer any questions you have.